person's behavior in the classroom, you actually have the ability to control and influence. Your own, that's why you're all so good. The worst teachers, when they give a quiz or a test or a homework assignment and the students do poorly on the students doing poorly is not the variable. It happens to every one of us, doesn't it? It's the response to the students doing poorly that's the variable. The worst teacher, when they give the quiz or a test or a homework assignment and the students do poorly on it, who do they blame? The kids, last year's teachers, the parents, hip-hop music, MTV, drugs, cable, society today, the kids all drive, the kids all have jobs, the divorce rate. I've learned if we're waiting for the divorce rate to fall to zero before we start teaching these kids, we're going to be waiting quite a while, aren't we? And it's that willingness to accept responsibility. Great teachers and poor teachers want very different things when kids misbehave also. Did you know when a student misbehaves in a great teacher's classroom, do you know what that great teacher wants? Prevention. They want it not to happen again. And when a student misbehaves in a poor teacher's classroom, you know what that poor teacher wants? Revenge. They want a public bloodletting. Did you know great teachers and poor teachers want very different things when students are sent to the office? Did you know, I know you won't believe this, but I promise it's true in some of the surrounding school districts. Did you know that poor teachers want students leaving the office mad? I had to teach my teachers, hey folks, we don't want kids leaving the office mad. Can I let you in on a secret? They came to the office mad. Some of those kids came to school mad. They walked into your class mad. If you want a whole bunch of kids coming in your class mad, please let me know because I'll tick them off and I'll send them in there. And you know why we never want students leaving the office mad and we never want students leaving the office embarrassed? Because they'll get revenge. And not on us because we're all such big tough adults, but they'll get revenge on somebody because hurt people hurt people.